Hello everybody, this is Mr. A Honda and welcome to Let's Play Life After Us The System! Man, this is a game! I don't know, anyway, that was stupid, but this is the game that we're playing today. This is part two of the Life After Us series. I did Shipwrecked, so if you want to see that, which is part one of the series, click one of the annotations over there, over there, I don't know, somewhere. And we'll, uh... You'll probably enjoy it, but if you've already seen it, let us continue. Okay, so we're here to get a girl. Ba 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 ba. Holy crap! This is these games are really pretty. The last game was really pretty. This game is really pretty. I'm quite impressed. Oh, there's a line there, and I don't know what it's for. I'm gonna crouch under it. I don't trust that line. I don't. Yeah, I know what it is. It's the trigger jump scare, isn't it? If I cross it, what happens? Oh, nothing happens. I made a new friend today. Dr. Tar. <laughs> he says I'm very pretty. He kept touching my hair. He must really like it. Or he want the booty. Gotta be careful, lady. There's uh, supposed to be a strict hands-off rule when you're a doctor. When you're a dur. What is this? I don't like it here. A man took Mr. Teddy away. She said I'm too... He... Why did I say I'm a mean woman? What the fuck's wrong with me? A mean woman took Mr. Teddy away. She said I'm too old for silly things like toys. He's not a toy. He's my best friend. I can't sleep without Mr. Teddy. I wish someone could bring him back. I need him next to my bed. Huh. Find Mr. Teddy. Mr. Teddy should be here. Teddy should be here. Okay, so there's blood everywhere. And Mr. Teddy should be there, so I assume that the woman child, 20 or something year old, would like her teddy back. This is a maze and a half. Oh, found the teddy. I've seen that teddy model before. Dr. Taller told me to meet him in his office, and I said, and he said not to tell anyone. He pushed, he put his hands on me, he touched me and smiled. I didn't like where he was touching me, but he said it was part of X. Okay. Do I have to go bring uh, Teddy Teddy Nubbins over here? Yes, I do. Oh, hey. Oh, the fuck. That was stupid. I blacked out, and upon awakening, I find myself still in the asylum, but something is wrong. The darkness surrounds me. And I feel as if I'm not alone. I must find the girl as soon as I can. Oh yeah, the darkness is definitely surrounding me, alright. Uh, Dr. Tall told me I'm pretty... And that I'm not a girl. He said little girls don't look as pretty as I do. He says I'm a woman. Okay. Ugh, so many of these freaking notes. Dr. Tar came to visit me at night. He keeps saying I'm very pretty. He got in the bed and on top of me. He kept telling me not to make any noise, but it hurt. He got mad when I shouted in pain and he hit me. He visits me every night now. <sighs> make me pr Oh! He wants me to be pretty. I guess I gotta find a head? Can I take the arms and legs and like move them around? Oh, those are real arms on a mannequin. Make me pretty. He wants me to be pretty. He gets mad when I'm not pretty. Okay. I'm uh, not entirely comfortable with this. What is with these little lines? I thought they were triggers for jump scares or something. Oh, hello. Can I pick you up? No, you're just... Are you a page from the Nepro Necronomicon? From Evil Dead? Looks like it. Oh, whatever. Uh, overlapping Burn action. <gasps> Burn, poop myself. Hello, bye. And he just stops moving. Where'd the motherfucker come from? What was he saying? Freya? God, I wasn't expecting some schmo to pop out of nowhere. Okay, so I can't even open that. 
was a waste of my efforts. Okay, that's the pretty thing. Uh, that's where I found the teddy. I'm assuming I have to find a human female head. But where? No, honestly, where would I find a human head? Of any gender. Mm. Uh, what was that? Well, there was something over there, but, you know, I didn't really see it, so. Uh, he gets so mad if I'm not pretty. He says, my head is so small and pretty. I started bleeding after he came to visit me last night. I wish I could go home. Um. Somebody should probably fire Dr. Tar. If that is your real name at all, Mr. Tar. Okay, let's go over here because that's where the spooky spook was. Okay. Apparently, my character is unable to open doors for whatever reason. Maybe I just don't have hands? But I'm able to read. Oh, what the fuck? What's in my way? What? Stupid colliders. Oh. Well. We found a human uh, lady, I think, head. Could be an orangutan as well, but... Oh, shut up. What are you... What? I heard noises. Oh, it's you. Oh, those are the monsters from that freaking game. They didn't model their own monsters? Huh. I've seen that monster and heard those sound effects in so many freaking games already. Not impressed with that. I am impressed with the level design, though. It's very beautiful. Probably bot, though. No offense. Holy shit, where, where's the mannequin at? Are you in here? No. I don't remember where to go. Oh, yeah, right. Wrong. I I honestly have no idea where to go. I completely forgot. Hmm. Found it. Okay, we're back. We're we're here. Oh, hey, I'll ring around the Oh shit. Oh, they're guiding me out. Oh, footprints. Oh shit. Once more I awake in this place. Mm, in this place that can only be hell on earth. Uh there is something holding me here. Uh, it will not let me leave. And something much worse is looking for me. I must something. Find the girl or probably something cliche like that. Um now what? Oh not that way. Oh. Been there and done this. Oh, uh, sitting with a hunch. That is not comfortable. Oh god, there's this thing again. Well, okay, that didn't change. Oh, hello. Huh. What could possibly be new in this? Oh, I guess a door could have opened. Or something of that nature. A new path. Hmm. Hooga booga. Hooga booga. Hooga. Oh, there's something new. I wasn't like tilting my head to look at it. The wire got stuck. Yeah, there we go. Oh, God. Oh, God. It's a nitty bitty skeleton baby thing. It was gross. Give me back my baby. Yeah, I don't want to go back with you. Yeah, he wants to stay with me. Oh, God. I took the baby. Why the fuck did I take the baby? 
Dr. Star... Dr. Tar stopped coming to visit me at night once he took my baby. He took him. He said I can't have it because it was a mistake. He took my baby and put him in a box. I could hear my baby scream as he set fire to him. I want my baby. Can I just give you the baby? Oh, God, you have an eyeball. Oh. Oh, it... He took my baby. He burns. He took my baby. Well, I just got the baby. Where do I put it? Do I just put it next to you? Can I? I can't even jump in this. Oh no, I'm stuck. Oh, I'm not stuck. Okay. Whew. I was able to jump in the last game. Take your damn baby, lady. Uh, I don't think I can really call you a lady anymore, but yeah, whatever. I'm gonna leave. Oh, where do I go from here? There's a random light over here. Oh, he burns. Oh, okay. I actually set fire to a baby. I didn't even get to read the last note. I now understand the horror of this young girl. Uh, the horror that this young girl went through while she was here. Such pain and suffering. To have been raped by such a monster and have her child taken only to be burned. I just can't comprehend. I can't wrap my brain around that. I don't, I don't know. Just, who the fuck burns a baby? I guess, eh, whatever. This game isn't as terrible as I thought it was going to be. It's not amazing. I'm not going to say this game is absolutely amazing, because it's not. It's entertaining, though. It has some rather scary themes. Uh, I keep screaming what he did to me. What? I keep screaming what he did to me and my baby, but no one cares. He wants to shut me up. Dr. Tar told me I was pretty and that I'm not a girl. He said little girls don't... Look as pretty as you know. He says, I'm a why is it repeating itself? Oh. Oh, shit, balls. Okay. Are you coming? There's a mosquito there. Can I just run by you? Okay, you're coming after me. Stop humping my ear. Oh, hey, you're humping my ear. Oh, and you're puking on me now, too. I hate the noises they make. Where the hell was he before? Okay, he was over here. Okay, was he hiding something? In no, I gotta go this way. Oh, hey, goodbye. Oh, you're still coming after me. Oh. Are you the lady that I need to see? I couldn't read the last note because the dude was chasing me. What is duck duck in my in my ear? Is there a baby crawling on the ceiling? Ah, oh, you son of a shit! Loading the end. Loading the end. Oh, is that it? So I found her and I died. Okay, now I can jump. Ah. <sighs> That was a sour ending. Uh, I didn't enjoy this one as much as I enjoyed the last one. But I did enjoy this one. It was definitely a darker turn for the series. And I will continue with the last one if that's... Unless there's a fourth, but I doubt it. Anyway, if you enjoyed, leave a like, comment, and subscribe to join the adventure today. If you want to help the growth of the channel, share this video with your friends or any... Freaking mosquito. Or any of the videos that I've done, because it really helps. Until the next one, I'll see you then. Bye. Holy shit! Yeah, that's right. Explode, motherfucker. Explode, motherfucker. Get it. Surprise, motherfucker. Oh, but now I gotta remember my way back.